All right. This is Firemind here. And today I'm going to show you how you can create this kind of portal-ish looking particle system. So this is a particle system which I created and I'm going to use for my game where I will be able eventually to shoot these kind of portals and then go through them kind of in like portal game style. So that's what we're going to create today. It's pretty straightforward, so please enjoy. All right, so I'm going to show you how to create a portal with a particle system. In order to do that, let's get it going right here. So let's click on effects, get on particle system. And right away, you start off with this particle system right here. Now, this, of course, is not really what we want. So let's modify it so it actually looks like a portal. First thing I want to do is come down here and change the render mode from billboard to mesh. And then the mesh, I'm going to use a quad. Now, nothing changes here, as you can see, but that's fine. So then we want to set, set the render alignment to world. And then we want to set the material to something that kind of looks like a portal. So here you have to like insert your own kind of uh, picture. Um, I just got happen to have so many like materials from other packages. So I'm going to choose the ring red. So you can basically use any kind of texture that has like a kind of ringish structure to it. So you can play around with that. I could also maybe use this one. Um, but you generally want something that looks, yeah, like a little bit like the edges of your portal are supposed to look later on. So pick that. Then you want to go here to emission. You don't want like 10. I'm going to use 2. And then the speed, the start speed, because we don't want this to be moving, I'm going to set that to 0. So it actually kind of stays in the same same spot. You then want to go ahead and click uh, on sh on shape, so you don't want shape. That way you end up with the static kind of image of this. So that's kind of what we want for now. And then we also want to like scale this up and give this a different color. So go to start color. And then here you want to scale this down a little bit. And then set the the color to something that you actually want. So in my case I want so I will make this a blue portal. So that and then you have to play around with these values to get some like shape that you think is fine for your portal so I want like a thin edge here and maybe that kind of glow on the outside not too much though yeah I think that looks fine for now we can always adjust that later and then go ahead and scale that a little bit so I'm gonna set that to two and this one to or maybe even three and this one to two. So now we get this kind of portal-ish look. I may actually set this to four. And then this to like maybe three. Yeah, I think that's fine. So, and then again, I'm not quite happy with the color yet because it's kind of like these weird edges to it. I don't want that. So let's see what we can do if we play around with these values a little bit. So this is really just depends on how you want your portal to look. So I think that's fine for now. I may come back to this later and adjust this later, but for now that's fine. You get the idea of how you do it. Uh, if you choose a different image, you might actually get a better result on these edges here. Uh, but that's fine for now. So I'm going to exit the color here. And now we want to set a rotation. So this kind of looks like it's moving. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to start rotation and then here we're going to click on random between two constants i'm going to set this to minus 360 and this one to 360 and now you can see that this is already moving a little bit and we're going to set the speed up to like 10 and now you have this kind of like waves in the structure here so it looks pretty nice and vibrant with energy and now you also want to add a light to your particle system just to make it look a little bit more nice. Um, so go over here and pick point light and that you're going to drag down a little bit 
and then you want to change the color kind of to your bluish to this bluish tint that you have set the intensity up to like three to make it look better and the range maybe 15 nah, that's too far so 10 is fine so yeah give that make it look like your portal emits light and that's it we're done that's how you create a portal so i can go ahead here so i can go ahead in my game now and look at this portal and see that it looks pretty nice so this is my portal right here get lost and yep so in so I'm building this for a kind of portal game. As you can see, the rest of this game is already like I have a laser gun and I'm going to take this gun and be able to shoot these portals and then eventually I'll also go through them and um, yeah, just make like a portal kind of ish game. And that's kind of the first step here, creating these portals. So yeah, I hope you liked this tutorial, found it helpful. If you have any questions, please ask me in the comments down below. If you like this video please leave me a like also if you want to see more tutorials please subscribe and if you have any other requests for tutorials can't find the tutorial you are looking for well just ask for it then just go to tutorial-request.com and check out if other people are searching for the same tutorial as you do if you find a matching request make sure to leave it a like so other creators always know what's in demand and if you can't find a request that you are looking for just create a new one. Simply click on new request, then choose a title, topic, and description for your request, and simply click on make request, and you're done. It's that easy. And with your request, you help creators know what's in demand. So go over to tutorial-request.com and sign up today. It's free.